Welcome everybody to Big Brain Movie Reviews. Today we are going to be talking about the Terminator movies. Hey, yeah. Well, let's go. We forgot to, you got to introduce people. Oh yeah, by the way, we also have Neptune. Hello. Crazy Jersey here. The greatest rapper all time. Not, okay, you're not you're not the greatest rapper on this podcast. Yes. You're right. on a, a different podcast. Not on this one. Yeah. You're nothing but Brandon yeah, on this yeah, podcast. Yeah, you're just Brandon. Oh no, 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 no. We're not rapping here. This isn't rapping Jared. This is not rapping Podcast. Brandon time. I know. Yeah, I know. this channel is not going to involve anything with music ever. <laughs> well, I'll tell My you poor so. table, first off. So, yeah, we're going to be talking. Today, we're going to be talking about a movie review. We're going to be talking about the Terminator series. And I asked Brandon on here because he actually likes Terminator. Just, I did a video. I mean, on it. I tore him apart when I asked him some parts, and he <laughs> could not, like, give me any. <laughs> But he says he's a big fan. I'm so. a huge fan. I know well, everything uh, about the movie. I jerk off to it. I'm joking. All right. Okay. Cut <laughs> that joking. out. Cut it. Cut. 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 <laughs> Cut. Anyway. So uh, we tried doing another podcast like last week and it didn't work out. The video got deleted somehow. Yeah. We were going to do video. Yeah, somehow. We were going to do. <laughs> Exactly. We were we were gonna do video con uh, video podcast, but um, it didn't work. Just didn't work out. So we're just gonna do audio only for yeah. uh, for the ladies. Oh, is and that gentlemen. the one you lost? <laughs> <laughs> just forget. He actually forgot to record. He it literally time. texted me no, saying, it, "I was, was editing lost. the video. I had it, and, it. and all of a sudden, I, everything well, just shut no, off." No, it freaking okay. So I edited the video. And it were everything was fine. I rendered the video, and it was rendered and ready to go. When I came back on later that day to post it, it was gone. Nowhere to be seen. It was off the face of the earth. Don't know if Even I even the unedited. I don't know footage. if I actually deleted it or or whatever, but it was gone. So yeah. Anyway, mm -hmm. back on topic. We're gonna be talking about the Terminator movies. It's all six movies. Yep. But for some reason, for some reason, the only gripe I have about the Terminator movies is the first three are canon. Like they, they're well, actually just the first two. The first, whatever, no, first two, first three are canon. Brandon. No, not yes, what, it is. not what it says. Well, the first two are actually what the story is supposed to be, and then it fucking spins off into other bullshit. I get, actually, I guess Terminator Three is canon as well. I don't really remember. Okay, so let's talk That's about Terminator One. Terminator One. No, fuck you. All right, all right, get off the podcast. Get out. <laughs> Go home. Walk home. Fuck you. So yeah, we're, we're all joking shit. here. And Brandon, please. So for now, the first the first movie I really liked it. Um, when I first saw it, it was actually pretty scary. The movie because you see the big burly guy and his fucking eye gets shot, and Why he shows the freaking glowing eye. My episode because Brandon Jared makes me happy. You know, I'm gonna lick you. I'm always with him, and he makes me happy. He's touching me. This is right. Call nine one one. But what did you think? What did you think of uh, Terminator One, Jared? Like it, like you just said, I enjoyed it. It was actually terrifying when I first watched it as a kid. It yeah, actually it was did traumatize scary me. As hell, dude, his fucking eyeball gets shot, and he Not shows the that. fucking when, he, when his eyeball <laughs> takes all, it out with a um, when his eyeballs cutter. fucked up. He's like, oh, I need to get rid of this real quick, and he just takes it. Well, think about it. He yeah, can't he fucking just stabs have his a eye. <laughs> eye blocking one. Yeah, of his but you eyes. didn't think that would be terrifying to see someone stab no, their no, no, eye no, with okay. a knife? When yeah, and then you find out he's actually a robot and just tearing it off. Yeah, he tears half his eye out. You think he was just doing it for fun? Well, this is good to go. If it's a fake eye, how do they see through it? Uh, it's 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 just like a contacts lens they use to blend uh, is, block their yeah, eye. but it's a full eye when he tears it out. It's uh, a full just full a eye, fake contact lens eye. That doesn't make any sense because it's, it's just a full a glass eye. eye. When Terminators, when they're made, they're made with actual flesh. Like they make the flesh itself. So the be eye like is just that still doesn't yeah. tell me how the fuck he sees through an a solid eyeball. It's just a fake eyeball that can. It's yeah, probably like it's coated. A, it's a full. It's a full rounded eyeball. Probably, he tears it out, and it's a whole thing. It probably has like it some uh, material to make him see through it. Yeah, but uh, you Maybe. know how like uh, you know how fake lens uh, eyelids or whatever that they for like blind people that don't want to wear glasses, but they have contacts. Yeah, contacts. <laughs> it's probably like a fake one with a contact lens. <laughs> you know that, that that like magical substance that makes you see through blind people. No, so my That's first time seeing Terminator. <laughs> you're not gonna ask me my so, first experience. Yes. Hold on, we'll get to eye you. contact lenses. It's like something like that, but more realistic. I don't know, dude. I, that's all I'm saying yeah. is how the fuck do they see through the unless they like scan through to make it like disappear. I don't know how they see through well, a solid once, solid. Once they eyeball. get into like dark areas, you can see the like the inside of the red, the pupil. You can still the see eye. the red, just unless more unless unless the the eyeball is whole, but in the middle is like yeah. it's like. 
like yeah, obviously. like drilled through a hole or something <laughs> That's, for his eye. Because when uh, ew, what the first fuck? off, what the fuck <laughs> I was that? In a bug. That was fucking disgusting. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> whatever, so, dude. In the first movie, yeah, when they're telling uh, Kyle Reese's is like where about like the whole Terminator inf- infiltrated his base, the what HQ about- they're in. Mm-hmm. It shows the Terminator killing everybody, and as he's as going to walk eye. through the. Uh, like a shadow that shows his red eyes through the pupils. And the Terminators can actually control how much well, red that's eyes probably, you can That's show. probably maybe maybe how they do it is because they have like in the middle of their eyes like drilled a hole in, the, in mm-hmm. their, their iris and pupil. Well, fun just, fact. Terminators can actually control how much they All right, you Brandon, since you want to talk so much, buddy, since you want to interrupt people, me, did you want to interrupt people? How is, how is the movie for you, huh? You never asked how me. Is, you just we, kept we, weren't, we didn't get up. to you, but how, how, how are you, buddy, huh? You want to speak... No, go ahead. No, no, no. Fuck go ahead. You. How how is Terminator One for you, buddy? Huh? This is what I was not go ahead. expecting to do. No, go no, ahead. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Right, he, go ahead. No, no, no. I, I, I insist. I insist. Go ahead. You the one. No, 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 no. Have the floor. No, 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 no. Have the floor. Have the floor. Your turn. Go ahead. May I please speak? Yeah. Go ahead. Please. Okay. As a kid, it was very terrifying. You know that scene where he was cutting his arm open? That thing yes. terrified me too. Isn't that Terminator Two? Yeah. Mute no, your that's phone. Terminator We're talking 1. about Terminator One. Mute, bitch. mute your phone. Whoever's phone that just went off, mute it's, it. It's Brandon. Mute your phone. I did. It's not muted. Hold on. Anyway, so turn yeah, off the notification. Sound. So my, I think my favorite part in Terminator One is when he went to the police station, and uh, they're like, he asked for I think Sarah Connor or yes. something. Yeah, he said, "Where's Sarah Connor?" And they're like, "We can't let you back there." And he'll no, be like, "That's not what he said." Or he he says, I don't know what he said. I'm, I'm just here to see Sarah Connor. What scene you talking about? Her. Can I see her? The, the one where he goes where he's in, in trying police. to he's trying to look when he's trying to go in and look for Sarah Connor, and they won't let him back there. So he's like, he turns to the cop and he says, "I'll be back." Oh, yeah, you're talking about that scene. That's like, and then he goes in the car, and he goes in the car and freaking yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, "I'm Sarah Connor." I was saying my favorite scene. I'm here to see her. Can I please go see her? And he's like, "Sorry, pal, she's still being interrogated." And he's like, yeah. "I'll be back." He's I looking know. around. Well, the, the there was structure. a video. There was a video about Arnold. He said, that "It's not I'll be back." He says, or, or is it, "James Cameron said I'll be back." I will be back. But yeah, but they, they had an it. argument or something. Like, uh, yeah, he, he, know, uh, an Arnold. Process. Arnold had yeah. an argument I with the, the director or something, and <laughs> saying you have to say "I'll be back." And, but but his he says, accent, he said, I'll be back. Yeah, he says something else. He, no, that he said really the wrong line. He wasn't supposed to say it. He was supposed so to say it. Scene? He was supposed to say, um, I, I'll be back. But he keeps I'll saying, be back. I'll be back. <laughs> no, but um, Yeah, that is my favorite scene. What is your favorite scene, Brent? Jared? My favorite scene is like at the very end when he actually show, when he, um, when his, shows his all his form. flesh is like all burnt away and he's just full robot. Oh, yeah. And he just starts that part chasing Kyle Reese. Yeah, I mean, yeah. That was the actual scene that actually scared me the most. No, no. Forget the <laughs> him cutting his arm open to fix his problems, his fingers, because it was fucked up. That part scared the shit out of me. Because when you're when you just see a normal man cutting his fucking eyeball out, you're like, oh, okay, he's just a robot. And you think, okay, maybe he'll never show his true form. That fucking scared me. And ever since then, that like part scared me. When did uh when did the first movie come out? Like 1984. 1984. So yeah, that the graphics for 19 for somewhere that in CGI 1984 bad, is really good. I yeah. I feel like in my opinion so CGI have gone downhill. Is there like a is it well that's practical effects, that's not CGI. Well, <laughs> mostly CGI. The robot is somewhat CGI, somewhat. Well, they made it Did they but have CGI that old? Yeah, yeah but yeah. it was How not think good. Star Wars was made. I don't know. Yeah, the original well, That's was, in the 60s. No, the 40s. first Star Wars movie was made back in 19, uh, 1979. Oh, yeah, 1970s? It's still yeah. really old, though, to have it's CGI. still good looking for the CGI. Yeah. Okay, so. So, yeah, what, Brandon, what is your favorite scene, did you say? Terminator 1? Um, yeah. Yeah, probably the cop scene where he just fucking mowed down like 70 cops in the station. Oh, yeah. What did he use? Dude, my favorite part is he used a shotgun kicks. and an M4. Where did he get the M4 from? He, he, he robbed took, a gun store. Well, yeah. He killed a gun store. Took the guns. Okay, I you can't know, remember what happened. No, yeah. so he went to a gun store. He went asking, to a gun store. Well, actually, no, he oh. didn't rob the person. He bought guns. Well, yeah, he went in he there. He bought guns. He was asking With them what like, money. 
He, Whatever no, money in the no, future. No, 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 think about it. No, okay. he he actually asked if he had a, pl- a plasma rifle. Oh. You don't. What's He's like, you have a plasma rifle? rifle of a wall of a forty four range. He's like, no, pal, just what you see here, Uzi nine millimeter. He he's like, he's like, all right, I can he take. He took a go. fucking Desert Eagle with a scope on it. He uh, took uh, a fucking was M nineteen eleven. Sure? I feel like it was a it was an M nine eleven. I thought I think it's a. I I I think it's not an M16. No, no, no. no. I'm talking about pistols. He took a Uzi. He took a he took a shotgun. He took a 12 gauge shotgun. So long since I've seen a lot of guns. He took the S12, which is like. And he is like, this is not enough, and he does kill the clerk. Well, Damn. Well, he said, he's like, what, the clerk said, what are you taking? He said, all of it. He's like, oh, congrats. We're closing. He pulls out paperwork. And he loses. He's like, I, you can't do that. He's wrong. <laughs> Blasts him. <laughs> he fucking flips across again. Because yeah. if I remember that shotgun, Damn. it's like a, it's a, they, they call it in Blackout, it's called like a S12, which is like a, like the, uh, that one shotgun. I can't think of the, the double name. barrel. No, it's, uh, it's, the, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's uh, one of those pump. Once. It's uh, it's it, they use it in Black Ops. It's I forgot the name for it. It's, ah, yes, Black Ops shotguns. It's There's 12. a lot of shotguns. It's a Spaz in, in there. Twelve. Oh, uh, he. 12. Uh, the Terminator had all kinds of shotguns, but one of them was an automatic one where he just like fucking. <laughs> that's what it's called. It's Spaz Twelve. It's an automatic <laughs> shotgun. Shoots twelve gauge round. Yeah, but it well, does, twelve rounds. Like you don't have to, you know, pump it like you, a well, normal you shotgun once. does. <laughs> so, yeah. And then it just kept sh- keep shooting. Well, you know, I think what is what is like the most like. Not that great in the movie. Like, what's your like least favorite part? Like, ah, oh, this is kind of cheesy. This is kind of kind of boring. Sex scene. <laughs> Damn, you got to see her tits. <laughs> That's the best part. Of my Sarah opinion. Connor. It was like, it, like I get it to make uh, John Connor, but Actually, come on, <laughs> you gotta have there, it. There you gotta, is, you gotta no, show. No, you you gotta at least have to show how cool how about it. it. I, I was know, but it was it was just not that great. No, no, no. Yeah. You guys want something cool about it? I was telling Zach about this earlier. Ah, uh, yes, something about cool. So, fun fact: there's a theory that John Connor wasn't the original resistant leader. Oh yeah, he was there's a about theory. That so when John, when the opening scene where the first Terminator movie was talking about the resistance, <laughs> there's a theory that <laughs> Sarah Connor is the real. <laughs> Resistant leader. When John was when when Kyle Reese was sent back, he actually fell in love with Sarah Connor, aka making John Connor. Well, I, I've heard the new target. Too. Sarah Connor is the one that started the yeah, whole, the whole rebel- rebel- resistance rebel- rebellion, and then, when, and then John Connor took over after she died. Yeah, and well, now technically, kind of. And then after the Kyle second Reese, the one, we'll get into it that later. Wait, wait, but, but one at a time, Sorry, damn. You, f- you talk first. I'll tell you mine. Jesus Christ. Anyway, they'll explain it in the second one. Like the whole timeline changed. changed. Yeah, since no, yeah. because because John Connor was born the whole timeline. Well, that timeline. also too, which I, I not agree. just that they'll switch. explain it in the second one, like yeah. they'll fully explain in yeah, the second one it. why it's so different, no. why the timeline. Mm-hmm. But also the theory goes is uh, when Calvary's was sent back in time, he changed the timeline to John Connor being the resistant leader yeah. and the mother being. We'll get the to that part command. when we get to. Didn't they the re- second one? in in the first movie they reprogrammed? No, that was the second one. The well, second how the hell did he reprogram him? Uh, John um, Connor is a hacker. Do you not know that? He, in I second, haven't. Not just that. I it, haven't watched these movies in. A it was long either time. John Connor that rebooted a Terminator to go back in time or in the second his, one, or it was either his wife at the time. Well, he didn't have really have a wife until the third one. Is the second one with the T one thousand? T one thousand liquid Terminator. Mm. That one's a cool one. Yeah, All right. Really so, uh, is there anything else you want to talk about? What's with your guys' rating? Uh, Ray, oh yes, for the rating for the movie, it's, it's a solid movie, good storyline. Uh, I give it like I, a, I give it like a nine. You bitch, nine out of ten. Kidding. I give it about a nine as well. Zach, you go, bitch. Seven. Really? I'm not a fan of. I'm not really a big fan. We're gonna of watch all the Terminators, bro. We haven't even finished one. You literally, we watched maybe like a quarter of it, and you're like, nah, I don't want to watch this anymore. That's our fate. Let's watch something else. Anyway, so yeah, we can talk about the second movie now. The second Terminator movie, two, remember, Judgment Day. The second movie, Damn, I remember right, a lot more around. than the first, be just because of the T one thousand, the liquid, the liquid Patrick. robot. Yeah, which is really cool. What's the actor's name? Robert Patrick. Oh, we forgot the. Okay, so the first. Okay, let's go. Let's re. Let's rewind to the first movie. Tell me all the actors. I uh, pull it up, Jared. It's. Um, I thought you had it. I thought you were Michael, all Mr. Oh, Michael Beaton as so plays um, who? Kyle Reese, uh, Sarah Connor, Limel Hamilton. Um, uh, Arnold for Kyle Reese was Michael Bean. Michael Bean, yeah, and then John Connor. Uh, John, John Linda Connor. Uh, Little ha- Hamilton. Linda is Sarah Connor. Is Sarah Connor. And then um, the cop. Uh, you literally asked Jared to do it. Let him do it. And then Arnold Schwarzenegger's T eight hundred. So Arnold, obviously. Uh, Arnold is a T eight hundred. Yep. Uh, Linda Hamilton is Sarah Connor. Uh huh. Uh, Michael Bean is it's Kyle Reese. Reese. Uh, the doctor, Earl Bion. 
He's the guy who's, Dr. who's the therapist that helps Sarah Connor. And uh, the the police chief, uh, and his name in the movie is known as Traxler, but the actor that played him is Paul Winfield. What the fuck? Okay. Names are right, Traxler. So I'm going to name rewind. my son Traxler. All right, back to... A cut resume. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to be talking about Terminator, Terminator 2. 2 now. The Judgment best movie Day. in my opinion. Now, this is one of my favorite movies because of the this liquid is like Terminator. everybody's favorite. It's the best one. It came out in 1991. This one I came out, came when did it come out? 1991. 1991. 1991. Well, your stuttering June doesn't really help. June 25th or June 7th. It's very specific. Okay. Has a problem. <laughs> anyway, so Terminator 2, Judgment Day. This is when uh, John Connor was born. Yep. And he's like about. I he's, he so so when I was doing my podcast for this episode, it said he was about ten years old when 10. he did it. Okay, ten. I thought he was. Is this yeah. when he was in the arcade? Yeah. 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 So this this is when he was like a, I guess becoming a mid teen or yeah, not mid teen. He was like no, no, early teen. He was between early. ten or twelve. Yeah. He's when becoming he a teenager. I guess is. Uh, Teenagers yeah. when you reach thirteen, whatever. Dude. Yeah, teenager. So anyway, 14, so this movie is really cool because of the. This is like something brand new. The li- nothing. Oh, no other movies have this so type of. Back then, didn't, love, I'm sorry. Okay. No, I'm saying this type. This type of like robot was not yeah. not really known. It's like a liquid. You don't have to raise your hand. Hold on. Let me finish my fucking thought, and I'll let you speak. <laughs> Just contain it. So yeah, the the, the, the the very the, the very interesting about this movie is because of the liquid. The Terminator. liquid Terminator, Terminator the T one thousand. It hasn't been shown to every other movie. This is like the verse movie that yeah. has. Well, a they do somewhat bring it back in the uh, Terminator Genesis, but we get. I'm that. Just, well, no, also T one thousand. I'm saying for the time. The oh yeah, yeah. Uh, the the 90, time. What was it? Nineteen ninety one. For like the nineties, is like the, this is like the plot point of a liquid like living organism. I guess living. Mm. Quote unquote. <laughs> I actually have a couple of facts about Terminator two. We can talk about later. Too. Yeah, but what were you gonna say when you were uh, blabbing shit. on? Uh, <laughs> I forgot. Hold on. This guy. Bruh, you this fucking dude. You the one. So what were you saying about it? Nothing uh, now. No, fuck no. you. Repeat what you said. So you I said the cool thing is about this movie is the the the, the, the this movie has the first like oh, in yeah. any movies. This is has a liquid robot. Like it's made oh, yeah. out of complete liquid. Because the CGI, like the whole like special effects the yeah, CGI, CGI, full on just fucking yeah. changed. After the first yeah, one. when he gets shot in the f- sh- uh, he shot in the face the shotgun, and they had a, the, the with the big hole in the head. They had to make it, a they had to make a th- oh yeah. Uh, hey, I was gonna say he did get a hole in his head differently. They had to make a uh, like full on a prop, sculpture, a full, yeah, a sculpture, yeah. a skull, cool. a full on thing to that, make that, it look. Re- I will like, say, John, real. Uh, real. Terminator Two was probably oh oh yeah. So fun fact, uh, not fun fact. I remember now. So Terminator One didn't have a big budget, so they didn't really have the money to like do a lot of the effects. How much? Okay, hold on. Look up how much money between. Er, let me look it up. How much money between... So, while I'm looking this up, uh, let me know what your favorite scene is. Favorite scene of this movie? Oh, there are so many of them. Um, when uh, John Connor's in the arcade and he sees a, a police officer and it's obviously the Nicker, T-1000. And his friend tells him, Gets hey, chased. Yeah. Arnold just comes out of nowhere, blasts the T-1000. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually... Oh, yeah. That, that, that's really cool when he runs. He's yeah. running and he's getting away from the cop and he turns he doesn't and know he it's sees... The cop. He thinks Arnold, and then he sees come Arnold come with the shotgun. shotgun. He's like... <gasps> Cause he's like, what the fuck? And he says, he says, get down, get down, come on, you gotta get down with my underwear. And then uh, the whole car chase and everything was so good. Yeah. yeah. What happened? <laughs> His mic just died. Oh. Hello. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> the whole car chase happens, and. Um, Arnold's just carrying fucking John Connor. At, uh, well, John Connor got on his bicycle. He's getting chased by a giant fucking truck that the T-1000 yeah. is driving. And then Arnold comes on our pit, gets him, puts him on the bicycle, and they just drive. And wow. By the way, cool. he was actually and riding a bicycle. Robot. He was just pedaling and really fast. the T-1000 is fucking ro- sprinting Jared, at them. You just yeah. said bicycle. So I can, can you imagine if he used a fucking like, bicycle? <laughs> he's <laughs> riding <laughs> his bike. <laughs> so can you guess how much money the first movie had? Give me, a, uh, give me a number. It was like well, like ninety thousand. Give me a number. I give about maybe because uh, James Cameron five hundred thousand when he per- pitched his idea. A lot of studios didn't budgets really back then were not that great. Low balling. It's a low ball. Like a hundred thousand. Very. Not even in the thou- hundred. Or not even one k. How much really? did they have for it's the budget? It's not a hundred thousand. So what was the budget of Terminator One? The Terminator One budget was six point four million dollars. Oh, uh, and they gross. They gross. They the money they made back. 
was seventy eight point three million dollars. Well, because when, that's a lot of when James Cameron money. had the well, idea. Of look at the money. Friend. Look at the movies now that have budgets. They're shit. They're now, let's, okay. So, how much money? Hold on. Let me what finish. do you want? You cut me off. I, you just, I, I, I know I deserve that. Yes, talk and talk so and talk. So, when James Cameron had the idea from Terminator One, he was trying to pitch ideas to like studios, except for the one that uh, it's I forgot the name of the studio that that directed it, but it was like C something company and that was the only one that pitched the idea how much money do you think the second one game like fucking 98 million is the movie called judgment day judgment yeah. day yes how Ju- much terminator 90, 90 98 point million i give it because it was a top so you said budget so the, bu- the budget so the money they got um, back from the first one was like 80 million right no it was um oh six point million okay seven, six million right Oh god! Did they got back? Hold no, on. they did double the Hold price. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Seventy-eight point three mil, which is pretty god good. Damn, they that was a lot, lot of money. money. They meant a lot. I'll of money say back. probably around that because. So you think it's seventy million yeah. for the budget? Uh, so for the ter- second one, yes. For yeah, okay. Saga. What about you, Brandon? For the budget? Yes, for the budget. Probably like twenty million. You guys are lowballing again. Again, a hundred million was the budget. Oh my god! Uh, damn, and that's I don't know, really cheap. I don't, I don't think it really says how much they made back. Well, if I remember, Terminator Two still holds the record for the top box office movie that has never been done before in a while. So I think it's like I think it's like ninety eight million, like for box office. They gained back, I think. Oh, right here, they gained their gross was two hundred million. Oh, that was really awesome. So they made they made back a million dollars. Well, it was also oh, they, it, it was the it the was a hundred million as the budget. Yeah, they, and they, they got two hundred so, million back. So they made a hundred million more. Dude, okay, if they, movies they can back. do you that today, yeah, yeah, yeah. like they can, like Godzilla, Godzilla like, minus one was like half the budget, and they, they no, did a lot. God, no, Godzilla's no, Godzilla's budget was, the, was really low. Was Fifteen million, and, yeah. and they did it with Terminator. They, they they basically pulled a Terminator and made it better, and they and budget like Marvel yeah, like like has like, massive budget, and their CGI is shit. You know what's funny? A lot of directors are realizing. I you know don't need a big topic, budget. but a yeah. lot of these directors now are like not a lot, but all the ones that have sense in their fucking brains don't need a big budget. <laughs> like Doom, like Dune, the budget for Dune two was very low. Godzilla X Kong's budget was very low, and that CGI was kind of shit. The gorilla, at least the the little baby one, in my opinion. What that movie? It looked good. amazing. What are you talking about? Not what I heard. You didn't watch it, so you don't have an opinion. Yeah, you don't have an opinion. It looked really bitch. good. <laughs> so anyway, um. What were we, we talking? We were talking the budget. So the About budget, the budgets, it, it, yeah. they made a lot of fucking money. Oh, like for in sure. the second movie, they made a hundred million. Like they spent a hundred million, they can't. They got back two hundred million. Yeah. I'm so sorry. they made a two hundred million. Are you sure million, that's they had the a, correct budget? Because I heard that's it was what more. that's what Google said. I'm for Judgment Google. Day two, box office budget. Yeah, I'm the, trusting the box Google. Off. Don't worry Google. about it. Just okay. so yeah. Um, so what? Yeah, what was your favorite scene? Your scene was oh. the guy. He was on the. He was gonna get shot, and he went on to the car or the motorcycle uh, and drove away. It was the the arcade in the car chase. Yeah. Okay. What oh, yeah. You? Where John's getting chased by a fucking. What about you? Tons of- what about oh, you, boy? So this this movie is such a master. It had so oh many God. good. Okay, I I will right say, I it's like my yeah. top yeah. second favorite. I don't have a first because there's so many. The part where Arnold is basically getting uh, when John comes back with a key to get to the vault for the the the, the T one thousand the first prototype chip and then the arm he's like the T eight hundred wait is yeah, this the, the one prototype. with the the black guy that actually was yeah the Mal creator? Dyson yeah yeah he was the one that made it so yeah this, this part is where the timeline changed this Ooh, is okay. I think I have my scene so this is where John's like hey I got it and by the way the cops are here and Sarah's like how many yeah uh, a anyway. lot. Oh, uh, you finish. I'll, I'll pause. No, okay. let no, 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 let Brandon finish. What are you yeah, saying? Finish. So he's like, "How many?" He's like, "A lot." He's like, and then Arnold's like, "I'll be back." He's like, "Where are you going?" You, you, you swore. He's basically saying, "You swore not." Oh to yeah, kill he anyone. made a promise, didn't he? He's like, and he looks at him. He's like, "Trust me." And he kicks the fucking window on the cops and the helicopter. Like, put your weapon down. And he just starts fucking blasting everything. There is no fucking way. Gun. There's cool. no way that no one got killed. Yeah. No, well, he he timed it. He gave the cops enough time to fucking run and hide. He was only shooting in their cars. He and maybe fuck shit five up. feet away from their legs. Yeah. yeah. Well, he also like when he was looking at the cop, he's like, "Hey, you fucker, better move." <laughs> okay. Go All ahead. Right. All right. So they got Sarah Connor back. She was in an asylum because she was still speaking nonsense about machines are coming from oh, the future. This guy is going to rip my oh. kid. <laughs> okay. Anyway. All right. 
So the T-1000 went after her and all that, and then they uh, go to, like, a place where the, the group of uh, outlaws and shit have, like, a shit ton of guns, and then they find out who no. was the original person that made the Terminators in the first movie. It yeah. was Enrique. It was there. It was technically John's, I guess, uncle, Enrique. He has, like, a... He was used to be a war <laughs> member. Hey, I'm just helping you out with facts. Anyway, um, um, and so they find yeah. the, the guy that made the Terminator the, in the Miles first Dyson's. place. Yeah, with his family. And someone's trying to kill him, right? Well, no, Sarah. So when when the scene where they 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 were in a car and they were you know running and and Sarah was asking Arnold a bunch of questions and he was explaining about Skynet August 29th yeah, and yeah, then yeah. he's like I have detail files on Miles Dyson. That's where she gets the idea to learn as much as she can to kill him. Because think about it, if you kill the crater, it could actually trigger Skynet early. Well, the reason hypothetical, w- hypothetical. That's what Arnold said. Yeah. Anyway, and uh, this guy had the arm of the original Terminator we, from the first movie and, and the, the chin. Oh, chin. yeah. Do we know his name? I don't remember. Is, is it doesn't say right there. Miles Dyson, yeah. the guy who played him. Uh, so, yeah, my favorite scene. So, I was looking for that. My favorite scene in this whole Joe movie. Joe Morton. You motherfucker. That's the actor that played Joe him. Joe Morton. Miles Bennett is the character. Miles Bennett is who he Dyson. played. Dr. Miles Bennett, I'm assuming Dr. that's his Miles. name. Yeah, because yeah. he's a. He's and he, he made the hand. I get. He, he made the whole. He made he the made machines the ter- or whatever. He made, he made the machines that like, came out with the idea of them, but he doesn't know that yet. Because it that hasn't happened yet. So his vision... And since he now has proof to fucking make these machines with well, this robotic arm and chip. Yeah. So in his eyes, he was trying to make a machine that can better the world. He was trying the, to make a, a, a pilot of, of a technology that can help <laughs> and all that. But The only gripe know. I have about the show or the about movie. this whole movie series is they throw fucking shit out the window. They're like, oh, new timeline. Oh, new timeline. Oh, new timeline. <laughs> Basically, I okay. fucking hate it. Okay. I don't like so yeah, when anyway. Sarah was killing him, trying to kill him, he shoot, she shoots him. I'm I'm sorry, Jerry. I'm trying to finish what I was trying no, to finish. Say. You finish. I'll, I'll, I'll <laughs> oh stop. My God. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so they go to him. Sarah's about to kill him. John Connor and Arnold right. come out of nowhere, and they did, they stop no, her. Don't do it. No. And no. then they convince him. They convince. Uh, she cuts Bennett. his arm off. They convince Bennett. To help them get the arm and the chip so they can destroy it once and for all. And so all the, the research they timeline done. can change. And it did. They fixed it because uh, the the war of the machines was supposed to happen back in the 1990s. Yeah. So that doesn't so, happen until like 2003. 2004. Well, yep. T3 was in 2003. It was made in 2003, but the war was supposed oh, to happen yeah, in 2004 yeah, yeah. for the new timeline. But no. Um, but anyway. So they destroyed the arm. They destroyed the chip. They did change the timeline, but it did not last. <laughs> Well, the reason why Sarah didn't kill Miles Dyson is because she knew she's not a killer. Mal- well, my favorite Bennett. scene. Well, that too. My Bennett favorite Dyson. scene in that movie to prove that he was a robot. Where he cuts his skin off. Yeah, he cuts That's his fucking cool arm and peels back and it shows the robot. Uh, like arm. You, like yeah. you say, it's that was like real. a badass That's scene pretty too. Sick. And fucking terrifying. Disturbing. Think about it. When you're when you're scared, shot in the shoulder. And how's he get a hand die. back? Does he get a hand? No, he hand? put the glove over it and called. He it put good. a glove and just wore a jacket the whole time. Um, He's like, look at me, I'm bad once, guys. Because uh, they actually explain it in Terminator Genesis that the skin can grow back, but it, just it takes, takes years, years to do. Right. Grow back? Yeah, yeah. It, it, that's kind of sick. The, well, Skynet has better technology and better yeah. than that. Something like that. But they right. explain that in Terminator Genesis. They never that's explained kind of it. Imagine any other if Skynet <laughs> didn't kill anyone, that technology could cure cancer. My other favorite scene is when the T eight hundred or no T one thousand gets put like he drops like acid was falling on him and that's he, Genesis. He came that's back Genesis. together. Oh, that's, oh, that's Genesis. No, well, then whatever he gets, he falls in the lava pit and he dies. Oh yeah, we're the part where whatever dude. Where he has I'm Sarah. Not, I'm not like here to pin. remember every little no, detail of these. My movies. favorite part is where Arnold is getting his ass beaten. As as much as I love the guy, he gets his fucking. Because they're both Terminators. Well, yeah, the, the one is supposed to be made to be the stronger. The T-800 than the other. Is, it's the, stronger, it's faster. T-800 so the, is the weakest. The, well, I thought he was supposed to be tanky. He is tanky, but, but the T-850 is more lighter. Stronger, I mean. It's lighter, the T-1000? too. T-1000. T-850, it's, it's a bigger version of the Arnold. God. And it's also lighter, and it could be it's more flexible. Yeah. He's bigger, but, but lighter? Yeah. Because <sighs> it's the new metal they made uh, that Sky, Skynet found called uh, Colton. Colton? That's it's like it's like coal and iron mixed together. It's also made, made out of um, lighter po- and poly ray ester and resists lava. I don't know if that's accurate. It is an actual life. life. Is it real? I well, Tegla has got real. a high pointing metal of like 800 Celsius. Yeah, but I did my research before. But this. it's resistant to lava because Skynet. 
every time when the chain uh, the timeline changes, Skynet still Skynet still remembers fucking shit from the past. <laughs> every time it's created. somehow well somehow it remembers the what happened. And they explain it in Terminator Salvation when we get to that part. That's weird. Anyway, what would you give your rating to this movie? A ten, a solid ten. It, the, the the fight it's scenes, good, the cinematic it's the scenes, the best one of the entire series. The acting, I give it a nine point five. Like the, there's my, no such thing as a ten. There's I a 10. give it a ten. <laughs> a ten. <laughs> I don't care. Jer- Gavin has the opinion. There's no such thing as a ten movie. There, there is a ten. A 10 movie. There are ten, a ten out of ten. Movies. <laughs> it's just, just very hard. It's very hard to find them. I give it 10. I like I it. think Ray Skywalker is the best. <laughs> this is probably my only favorite I'm movie. Joking. Get the fuck out of my <laughs> life. I what did he say? Talk to you. He said Ray, Ray Skywalker's, Skywalker's the best, best Jedi, Jedi to ever Dude, existed. Dude, you pissed off a lot of people. <laughs> I'm fucking with you guys. Skate sucks. Dude, ass. I fucking hate that. I, we're not even talking about Star Wars. <laughs> okay, All right, back. we're talking about Terminator 3, and this is where I think Rise it starts. Three, Rise of the Machines. This is where I think it starts to, like not becoming that this great. This is the... This is uh, oh, the f- tell me that fun fact, Jared, Gab, Brandon, about ju- uh, term. Uh, no, this movie, Terminator. 3. You said that. Well, it was this I got movie. a couple of fun facts about Terminator. Two. We'll talk about it later. Um, so fun. I said, is there anything else he wants to talk about? But Terminator okay, Two. So he said no. Fun fact. Um, James Cameron. So Arnold wasn't really supposed to surprise his role in Terminator Three, but he went to because he wanted to work with James Cameron because James Cameron and him worked for a long time. They're good friends. So he goes to James Cameron saying, "Hey, I don't want to do this movie." And James Cameron looked down dead in the eye and said, "You should do it," you but must. asked for more money. So what he did is exactly what he said. So he they offered him thirty million for this movie. That reminds me, thirty million. There. Yeah, they they offered. They told him. Uh, Ar- Ar- Arnold Arnold said, "Give me what much? 30, he, Give 30 me million. thirty million and dollars, and I'll there. be in this movie." And they fucking just because they want know, well, they wanted Arnold because he's crucial. To, if you don't have Arnold in a Terminator movie, the movie's gonna well, most likely flop. Terminator literally Arnold is he's the, the so face. Right. He's he the, face. the face. James Cameron made he's him the face Terminator. So can you get? Can you tell me how much this budget was? So I ain't gonna buy Thirty-eight million. Come on, give me a guess. Thirty-eight. Oh, that okay. is a low ball. Okay, ninety million. Three hundred million dollars. It's high bar in it, but you're three hundred ninety. Closer than him. Three. <laughs> ten hundred thousand. Ten million. You are low. Ten hundred thousand million. You are Ten hundred thousand. That's not even a number. I don't fucking know how much. It was. Um, one hundred eighty-seven. Point three million. Damn, this one went up more. No, it oh went God. more. Gavin, Jared, no, it did go higher. No, it, it did. Um, the the second movie, the first movie, I think they only had um, six million. Six million. Six million dollars. The second one was only a million, and this one is a hundred million. So this one's the lowest. No, the second one was a hundred million. This one's like. See, this one, once has, again, this one only has you don't need more million a big more. budget yeah. to make a big movie. Um. Oh, another cool fact about Terminator Three. <laughs> So you know the part where they're on the crane and the crane's going through the building? Uh-huh. Apparently they were afraid they were putting too much money into it. Also, it was going to make schedule time. So Arnold threw in like $1.3 million to help with that scene so that that scene can happen. So they made they made back, so they had one... Uh, one I think... One, eight, one, yeah. Uh, 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 one, $187 million. Million. They they Which made a lot of they money. made back four hundred and thirty three million dollars. Uh, too bad. They made a lot more back than they made. The budget was a little lower, and they still made their money. budget from the last movie went up eighty uh, eighty seven million. million. Oh. So let's talk about it, baby. Oh, yeah, mommy. I don't really remember much who, about this movie. Who to be are honest. you? What have you done to Zach? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, great. <right. laughs> what is this movie about again? I can't remember. So okay, so Terminator since three. the time, give me, give me a let quick, me, give me, me give me a quick. Oh, it's your podcast I'm summary. Sorry. All right, so summary. Quick <laughs> summary. <laughs> anyway, Terminator Three: The Rise of the Machines. Since the timeline all changed again, the next war was gonna. The War of the Machines was supposed to start about in 2020, uh, two thousand twenty. Two thousand four. This movie came Basically. out in two thousand twenty two. Or. 2002. Damn, that's really good for its money. This right here came out. 2003. This right here came out in 2003. (laughs) It says says April to September 20. Whatever. It doesn't matter. It came out in the early 2000s. Okay, so so, uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger is back as Terminator again. Mm -hmm. And he was hacked, and he was supposed to protect John and John Connor's future wife. 
Is Cap- this the Kate one with Russo. the blondie? The blondie turns That's yeah. a TX. TX. So this is in this She's movie. She's faster and twice as strong. How is this movie? This I heard this movie was the worst one in the series. I I, I liked it. I really liked I it. I swear that so, this one was the worst one. And this one. one, John Connor. It is, but the budget doesn't fucking matter. So look. <laughs> Damn. So Jared's right. So fun fact. We'll um, when... Salvation. So uh, the since Arnold and John had that special connection, T2... Uh, they Skynet used that to their advantage and killed John Connor and Captain Brewster captured the Terminator re- and think, okay, I could just use this Terminator. And she sent that Terminator back in time yep. to protect them both so John wouldn't die again. Mm-hmm. And think about Skynet this. Skynet gets smarter every time when they change the fucking timeline. Yeah, but does the, the and Skynet, Kate Brewster the Skynet, outsmart the Skynet. Skynet. Skynet and this... Ah! <laughs> does Skynet remember every time that the, the new... Yeah, it yes. loses. How? Because it's, it's reborn. Not, it's an AI that has gained intelligence so far that it can literally remember everything in the time. That doesn't make any sense. I don't remember that part, but that's It does. Awesome. That's literally, they explain it in the movies. When? Sky, Which movie? Uh, Genesis, especially. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's right. I remember now. Because uh, literally, cause when they were talking about it. And several times. We so remember like, everything. Since yeah, Skynet okay. is now known as Genesis in the movie Genesis, God. he straight up says, I am Skynet, just now known as Genesis. Okay, that makes sense. I, I forgot about that part. <laughs> Skynet cha- uh, remembers every fucking thing that happens. And what's funny about this, John Connor's not even the, the one that uh, gives the command. Kate Brewster is the one that gives the command. John is just like the second in command. It's hilarious. Because yeah, anyway. it's funny. Shit. Anyway, so back to Tomb Raider 3. And then also, I'm sorry. Uh, the reason why uh, John wasn't what's on the, the actors for this movie? Actors. Um, Kate Bruzen was placed by. Is there any big names? Arnold. <laughs> he's he's literally in every movie except one. No, he's in all. There's some good actors. In yeah, this but one. he's he's only he's not actually in this movie. He's just my phone. CGI'd him. <laughs> what are you no, that. What? I'm pretty. Isn't it? He's I in swear. every Terminator movie. I swear. He's, he's in, literally he's in every single I thought one. he was. Well, Wasn't he president? Salvation is so the one he's, he's actually CGI'd. Whatever, man. I don't get paid to hit sit here and listen to this bullshit. I'm trying to find the actor. So anyway, yeah, my favorite scene is I don't remember, so I can't give <laughs> you one. I actually know. I lied. My favorite scene is actually when the acid gets spilt on the this liquefied T- T-1000. Or X, whatever the fuck that thing's called. Wrong movie again. Dude, what movie are we talking about? Terminator 3 with TX. I don't remember what happened. She has a flamethrower and a plasma gun in her arm. I I think it's the reason why I don't remember this is because it's dog. (laughs) Okay, fine. My favorite one, she when she fucking explodes. And she dies because that bitch is slut. (laughs) I think she gets her 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 body gets trapped. I don't know if this is him or whatever. John Connor. But John uh, Edward Furlong. Ezra Scissorhands? No, that's fucking Johnny Depp. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, sorry, what were we saying? Uh, I don't know if this is right. You're the only one that actually knows this. Is Edward Furlong the actor that played John Connor? Let me see his face. In the original one, yeah. Where's his face? He has changed. Let me see his face. He's done. He's done, he used to do drugs. Ugh. That's the reason why he What wrote. happened? So, no, fun fact. He did drugs. God damn. <laughs> he did drugs. That is a change. Zach, he did drugs when he was a teenager. And you're going to make me do drugs right now if you don't stop talking. So, no. So, <laughs> as before we get on more. So, technically, they wanted him to reprise his role as John Connor in the third one. But due to substance abuse, he wasn't able to return. Yeah, who, who the, made him? The who kid made, of John Connor, the, the original one. He want he they wanted him to reprise the role. Well, now I'm saying who now is um, who's taking his role? That guy I just showed you. I think the guy that think that's him. him. That's him. I think. All right, you know, this, this is becoming too crazy for me right now, and I don't really uh, easy right so now. I'm gonna fuck you. What is your favorite part about this movie? Why we're waiting? Okay, uh, I was wrong. Nick, that was wrong. I was, was wrong. wrong. The one I showed you is the kid. Oh, it was John the kid. Connor? Was, is this the new the John one? Connor? Nick something. Yeah. That guy? Ew. He actually Nick did Stone. a pretty decent role. He's Nick's, an ugly motherfucker. He did it right. <laughs> of course, he's not the best looking. So what is your favorite part about this movie? Ooh. Anyone? <sighs> hey, 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 hey. You cut me off too. Go ahead. Go, go, go. We don't have time. We have, uh, we have a crunch. No, we don't. I at least want to keep this 
An hour. Um, it's where you're not gonna make it. <laughs> There's six movies, man. We're only on movie four. Actually, Jared, you, you go first. I can't. Uh, you go first. You don't have part. a scene. I'm trying to think. You're Mr. Love in this movie. You don't have a scene. <laughs> Jared, go, ahead, go first. Jared, okay. You better I, not interrupt him. I don't want to hear a peep at you. I'm trying you. to think. I swear to God. <laughs> go ahead. No, my fa- no, no. <laughs> my go favorite ahead. scene from Two Married Three is when uh. Uh, jo- uh, Arnold sacrifices himself to save John Connor and his future wife oh. by holding the door open because it was sliding down, and the TX is like almost fully destroyed. He grabs the wire. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. And she right. explodes. Uh, oh, no, that, he that is he takes his power core. Oh yeah, did he? Shoves it in her Wait, mouth. didn't he do that before? He literally no. did that before, and There's, he threw it out the window and yeah, explodes. Two, that was has, part of it. He has two nuclear cell uh, cells. Yeah, and these are and the things like, that keep them. Alive. They're like new. They're like mini nukes, basically. Yeah. No, I, as, as as long as he has one in him, he will be fine. He's he just, just he's gonna be a little bit weaker, and he won't live <laughs> and as a longer. Bit slower. He won't live as longer because yeah. this model is a T fifty T till T eight fifty T eight fifty bigger it's, version of the T eight hundred. It's basically more buffer and a lot. It's more. Combat-y. They show it in selfie. Didn't they CGI his body on a? More muscular man. No, that's that's no. They T4. they kept him as he is since he is a bodybuilder. Technically, but they CGI the uh, most of well. This the movie came out. Parts. This came to it two thousand. I think he's retired from lifting. No, he still lifts. No, he still lifts. Anyway, just not so. As no, much. my my favorite part is where what Jared said. That's such a good scene. It's just his last moment. And when he comes out of the chopper, he's like, yep. "I'm back." <laughs> he's fucking like all like almost fully exoskeleton. Yeah, like, Mo- all, like half and then of his he, skin and, then, and tissues And the like bunker gone. door was almost open Until I realized there was a, a fire And it obviously is, is designed to like If something goes off it's designed to shut right away So it obviously keeps the people alive He jumps under the door with his damage One of his damage arm he's holding it open And then the TX is still alive but Her legs are just all fucked up He grabs the wire and you know drags her down Blows her head off You want to know how weak the T800 is It can only lift It can lift like a thousand pounds. I think it was only a thousand or five hundred eleven hundred pounds. 500, well, yeah, 500 it's not count. supposed to be that. Str- it's supposed to be strong, but not Jared, that. Strong. Brandon said. Brandon says he can lift. They, it can lift the bus. No. Well, it can flip a, a bus. bus. Is, a bus is over. In the Sarah ton. Chronicles, yeah. it can flip a bus on its side. On its side, that's fair. Do me a favor. Go in my room, grab a rope, and, and tangle myself. <laughs> no, he told me to go kill yourself. myself. Cancel Zach. I didn't say that. I didn't say kill yourself. I didn't. Sp- that didn't I'm offended. I want my lawyer. Anyway. <laughs> what is your least favorite part of this movie? I can tell you a lot. <laughs> the woman. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> I don't like the I don't like the new robot. I don't know the why. The TX? Dumb vibe. Arnold's me. the one that recommended her. Not a. No, it's not her as an actor. I'm saying as. Just the, the robot. The design of it, it's yeah. ugly. She's a TX. She's supposed to be faster. It's ugly. Shut the fuck it up. It felt more like future, more future. I just don't like the design of it. It's ugly. I don't like that. Not saying that she's a bad actor. I'm saying her design is the yeah, like the design, the, my, my the design of this robot. Part in that movie is where looking. Arnold walks into that strip club for men. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot about that. No, it's not for men. It's it was for, for women. Girls. It's for women. It, it, and yeah. male okay, strippers. Right. It, it was shit. funny. It was a what? good comedy idea. Okay. But yeah. Arnold is like, he's like, give me, take off your clothes. He's like, here you go, sugar. <laughs> he fucking grabs his heart as fast as fucking ass. Yeah. Uh, <sighs> like with the scene he's talking about, he walks in into this Naked. A woman bar mm-hmm. and there's male strippers <laughs> just dancing, <laughs> taking off their clothes and everything. And all the women just look at Arnold and he's like, but no, no, a cool fact. And then, uh, oh, I'm sorry. And uh, he goes on stage, and the guy's like, "Relax, honey. Wait, wait your It'll turn. Be your turn soon." And he's like, "And ours is like, give me your coat." And he's, just, he's no. like, "Talk to the hand." Is he naked in this? Yeah, well, he's naked in every beginning movie. Actually, oh, he's wearing. Apparently, he was. How wearing, am I supposed to know this happened in the beginning? Every time when a Terminator is supposed, or or anybody that goes I through know. the time machine, they have to be naked. Well, I, how was I supposed to know this is the beginning? So, you didn't specify that. Zach, it's the beginning. So, how am I supposed to know? Jared, hold on. So the time displacement system cannot bring anything back dead. Anything that's not a living no, organism. No, no, no. no, it can't is, bring cannot. anything back like clothes. It can't bring back. It clothes. has to be living flesh tissue to go through the pole. It, yes, it's anything that doesn't have a, a beat. It, it's if it's if there's clothes, if there's like anything like metal goes through the portal, it the cannot. portal will fucking explode and kill everyone that's in it. It'll disintegrate. It most likely do. <gasps> so, um, yeah, that's this my first. This is like thing. why anyone asked. 
I asked you what's your least favorite. That's is that your I least said. favorite? You yeah. said it was your favorite. It's funny, but Didn't it's not Didn't he just say that was favorite. his favorite? He it's, did say it's his least favorite, but it's funny. It's funny. Okay, what about you? Um, I swear he said it was his favorite. Uh, I'm going to fuck you. I, I don't know anymore. <laughs> I don't know, bro. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this episode uh, to is. To be honest, Connor's wife was kind of annoying. Catherine Brizer. Are we just sexist on this podcast? <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm and the reason why I say she's like annoying and shit, because she's just like, I don't believe there's a robot. Blah, 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 blah. And then she uh, sees yeah. Arnold and he's like, Bacon. Cat, she, she, yeah, and he's like, like I still don't believe. And John, oh, what was funny is the part is that scene is where John is literally You're giving faking. up all hope. And he's over there. He's like, she grabs a fucking G16 gun and she's like, go ahead, shoot him. It's not going to change anything. Anything. She fucking shoots me. He he's fucking spits out the bullet. And yeah. He's like, she don't shot do that. Arnold in the head, in well, the mouth. He he caught it. And he they even caught it. It just got stuck in his mouth, and he was able to get it out with. And spit, he with shows his the bullet tongue like, and just and fucking. It, spit thing. He's like, don't do that. Don't do that again. He's like, don't fuck me again. So what'd you give this rating? Uh, I'm gonna give it like a a, a seven point five. Did I ask you guys what the best part was? Yeah. Okay. About your favorite part. What about your My favorite, favorite part's when he screen shoot that bitch. So we all agree that play that was. She oh, disappears. Yeah. I don't have to see her ever again. <laughs> I just don't like the design. That's it. That's my only gripe. Why? Because she could flay her boobies. <laughs> Can she? Yeah. yeah. It literally when the cops. She's a shapeshifter. So, She's like the T one thousand. So in a scene right. where she gets pulled over and she so looks wait. at a Victoria's Secret and said, "This they is just the new recycled sexy. the same yeah but robot." Made they her a did, girl. but they also put an exoskeleton in it to make it faster, they stronger, also with smarter. The so it's basically like the last movie. It's like the Rev 9, okay. but a girl version of it. Anyway, what would you give the rating, Brandon? 7.5. And you? I give it a 7. And I give it a 0, because I don't, I don't like this movie. <laughs> On to Salvation. A, this one was a, a little more better. I'm a 6. Salvation is actually one of my is favorites. This the one oh, where, yeah. Is this the one where there's actually a cyborg or like a... Uh, um, so Which I, movie is this one? So this one is I, a, well, but recap. Let me talk, please. Jesus. Give me a recap. 30 seconds. Go. <laughs> 30 seconds is not enough. Anyway, Salvation is about during the war of, of the Against the Machines. Skynet. During, what is this one called? This one's called Salvation. Terminator Salvation. Salvation. Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. And uh, Christian Bale, okay. a.k.a. Batman from Dark Knight, is in yep. this movie. And, and he's playing John Connor. Why is there so many people playing different Okay, go ahead. And... Um, and uh, Sam Wormerton that plays who? Marcus, He's aka Marcus. the He's first T one. He's the first, the first eight hundred prototype. T eight hundred. He's the first ever Terminator. Show me what he looks like. Give me a second. Show me. He's the first ever Terminator that actually has consciousness of his actual human self. Well, also, Jared, he's the prototype of the T eight hundred that they exactly. were experimenting. And they what? left his memories in that brain. Yeah, he had a heart too. Yeah, that's what I'm asking. He's a cyborg, whatever. He's the blue yeah. avatar, people. That's what I just asked. Like, no, it's not the right movie. <laughs> what movie are you talking about? That's the movie I'm talking about. That's he's a cyborg. Or what the fuck he is? I don't know. He is a cyborg. All Terminators whatever, are dude. cyborg, but he's more and cyborg one, he's than they actually are. fucking gaslight me um, saying I'm saying the wrong fucking movie. John Connors actually has a wife in this one. I don't think it's the same girl, Kate Brewster. It's Bruce not. Or, okay. It's Kate. <clears throat> How much money do you think this movie made? Or how much? What's the budget? This one is. I think this was a little lower because it didn't really do so well. Yeah, this one was more based like realism, like how the Dark Knight movies are. So. Like, more like realistic. Give me a number. Like the budget for it? The budget to make this movie. I'm going to say. It will shock you. I'm going to say 25 million. How low is he? He's low balling. I'll say. Hold on, hold on. How much you say? Ten million. He's low balling. Go ahead. That's even lower. That's even lower. Lowering. It goes higher. I oh, said, it's higher. I said I low balling. You know what that oh. means? Low Thir- balling means you're going way too low. Thirty million. That's my final one. Oh my god. You're million. locked in. Thirty million. Two hundred. You're still wrong. You're right on the money. Really? Two hundred mil is what this movie made. Uh, it does not say how much money they made back. Oh wait. Um, it says nearly two hundred million to pro. Uh, wait. What? Let me read it. While the movie did manage to make nearly two, I think they made their money back what they made it for. So the budget was two hundred million. Yeah, and they got back three hundred and seventy one million. Oh, okay. Well, that was simple. I could just fucking read it. In <laughs> What's the next movie called? So the movie so, nationwide made thirty seven point. Uh, Genesis 3, is the next seven point one yeah, four million dollars. I'm just looking up for the next. That's how much edition. the movie made nationwide. Yeah, that's the exact same thing I just read. Oh, good. <laughs> The, 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 I, I asked for the budget, not how much money they made. They made a lot of money. They only made a hundred k back. They're making a hundred mil. K. They've only made a hundred mil back. I mean, 
And that's lower than what well, they no, had they before. They made 170 million back. That's lower than what they made before. Yeah, because no, this one was no, that actually, good. no. Never mind. That was the it was, same. It's way more. It gets. <laughs> yeah. it, it got worse than. But bad. is it bad rating? It, did, it didn't. It didn't really receive very well. Which one? But for some reason, people are liking it more and more and more. This one they realized the Bell it's not one, right? as bad as it looked. Exactly. <laughs> Genesis and and Dark Fate was the terrible one. The only thing I remember of this movie is. Uh, Marcus, I think John Connor or, or the robot or the Marcus, cyborg robot guy Marcus. wakes up and he gets trapped and hung up and the robot com- or the robot was coming and then someone no, cut him well, down. Well, Marcus comes out of the hole. Or maybe maybe the robot's the one that got caught up and started Yeah, shooting. the T six hundred. Yeah, uh, there was. I can't and remember this, it all. In this movie, there was like different like different variations of the same Terminator. I'm gonna pull it on record. I don't know if I said this a thousand times now, but I have not watched. Most of these movies, I'm just rem- I'm Genesis. just guessing. I mean, not just. you're remembering what you have seen. I have. I'm just re- regurgitating no. so, what I've seen. And this one is before the T one uh, the T eight hundred was made, so they had a, a yeah. rubber series called a T six hundred. They had. A, is this the one that's big and bulky? No, yeah, that has the mini gun. The T they were making two different variants of the Terminator, mm. newer variants. Yeah, which was the T eight hundred and T eight fifty. Before that, it was either the seven hundreds and below. Because they were older a, yeah. and they were trying their best, like there was different variations too. They, there, there were there rubber ones skins, that were just like crab looking ones. There's ones on treads with mini guns. Does this take place just in the future, or do they go back like, through time? So this is 2018's future. Yeah, they stay in the timeline of the wars going on. Damn, this is before Skynet got laser guns. This and is all before, this. oh, I think this is uh, this is the movie where like the the cyborg guy he doesn't know that he's a cyborg. Yeah, because yep. he's his program to be human. He is the first program, the one the Skynet actually successful. Yeah, it's just not real. But no, so Marcus wakes up and he doesn't know what the fuck is going on because he is he, he a believed, full on robot or is yep, he like yeah. a living full organism? Robot, except. His, his heart, heart and his brain are the only things that are not robots. So that's cyborg. So yeah. Marcus goes to L.A. And Basically he, like General Grievous, but he he goes to better. L.A. <laughs> and he's like, Damn. what the fuck happens? And then he sees a person that, in the distance. I mean. Remember, this is a T-600 series, and they have rubber that's skin. That's the one with the minigun, right? Yes, yeah, this is the one with the well, grenade launcher. He has launcher. no skin. Well, it's rubber. It's, he does have skin. Kyle Reese said in the first good, Terminator, like the they, when they first started appearing, they had rubber-based skin. They weren't yeah. realistic, but they had rubber-based skin. This is when they didn't have a time machine. And then this is where the Skynet was still trying to figure out how to make it look more human. Mm-hmm. So is John Marcus, Connor alive in this movie? Yeah. Well, yes. yeah, and this I is also where you meet his... Bales, John and then you meet his... Am I supposed to remember every little thing? you can also meet John Kyle Connor, Reese. A.K.A. the main character. <laughs> <laughs> and this one also... What about Sarah Connor? No. She's alive in this movie? No, she did. She died. She died Damn. of cancer. Damn. This movie is actually supposed to take place after Terminator 3. Like, they literally, the director said, this is supposed to take off after Is this still one. take place in the same timeline? Yes. Yeah, yeah differently, though. So, Just and this one actors. is Kyle Reese is a teenager, and he meets... Cancer. Marcus meets Kyle well, that's Reese. that's how it's supposed to be. John Connor is supposed to meet his father. Yeah. That's a teenager in the future. <laughs> but not Marcus. But not, not Marcus. Marcus is a whole different So, thing. what's your favorite part of the movie? I'm losing interest. Why? Um, so Christian Bale's trying to destroy the factory Ooh, that Skynet made, mm-hmm. and um, and uh, d- they release uh, John. Uh, the first scene I really liked is Arnold, but CGI'd, oh, yeah. making him look <laughs> fucking younger. buff as shit. Little <laughs> 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 fucking like, door well, they they c- they CGI his face on a like, no, they bigger CGI'd body the body. Body. same bodybuilder as the guy. Well, I know. I'm saying Arnold. the the bodybuilder that they got it from was a younger yeah bodybuilder. He had the same tone as Arnold. Yeah, as yeah. but anyway. And this is when they introduced the, the T-850. This movie came out in 2009. Was it the T-850 that was first introduced? Mm-hmm. I thought it was the T-800. They literally said that's the T-850. No, T-850. So when did they use the T-800? The T-800 was already made. They literally, they fight it in the in the basement. They fight the T-800 in the basement. You have to show me the scene. What's your favorite okay. scene? That, anyway, what's, uh, what's going on? So they go to the basement. The uh-huh. T-800, one of the T-800s that they're making wakes up and tries to kill John Connor and the cyborg guy. Oh, I think that's my favorite one. Did he kill him with a fifty cal or something? No, they uh Was no, this that's the, for in general. Was this a deleted oh scene? Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, was this a deleted something scene? Something happens where he don't, kills or er, shuts off or something. I don't remember this scene. Uh, <laughs> so this terminator starts going on a He has rampage. no legs. No, he has legs. That's the first one you're talking about. Oh my god. <laughs> so John Connor is struggling to fight against this T eight hundred. And then he unleashes lava on top of the Terminator. But since this is a new material of metal that they that Skynet has harvested to make these T-800s, it's it is resistant to lava. 
and then they try to freeze him with like uh, carbon Wait, dioxide. I or thought nitrogen. that was the same robot that yes. he was fighting in, like the T fifty. No, the TA fifty was upstairs. He tried blowing that one up with a grenade launcher. <laughs> mm. So I thought it came downstairs. Nope. Are you no, sure these are robot. two different ones? Yep. Two different ones. I believe you, Jared. You he's, to, a movie, he's a no, movie guy. No, this I, I this movie is literally one of my top favorites. I know what Ew. I'm talking about. You, okay, Jared, when we get off, you Sorry. have to you have to show me because I, I believe it. I just need to be shown. You can tell literally can well, tell we'll by the size the of them. Oh so, yeah, shit, that so makes difference. He gets he gets sprayed with nitrogen. Yep, and he the lava freezes over and then it slowly he's just fucking like <laughs> breaking I feel like apart, that was the same robot. I vaguely lava, remember that. And uh and then he continues, and he punches the cyborg Marcus right in the heart. Uh, the ro- the T eight fifty did, or no, no, no. The, the cyborg punches the cyborg right where his heart is, and just kills him. So before, and then okay. So to make it understand, the T fifty, the T eight hundred, whatever, the T eight hundred blew a hole through the cyborg. Not really body. through a hole. Like he knew where the heart is, and he's like, because he scanned it. Yeah, he scanned the body, and he sees the heart, and he knows that's the weakness. So he just fucking like full on just. Stops so the T eight hundred basically killed the the cyborg. Cyborg, and then John Connor comes in or gets and killed. Tries to bring him back and has to use electricity to bring him back. Oh, that was good too. And then without he, his heart. Mm-hmm. No, well, does he even need a heart to live? Because he's a robot. Tech. But and, <laughs> so, and then he comes back. His hand, and he also had earlier. His hand was uh, fully burnt off by lava. So he and has he a also feels hand pain. Showing. Oh. So and. He takes a metal bar, shoves it right in the throat of the T-800. And it rips his head off. And full-on just twists the head off, and the head goes flying. I'm pretty sure that bar would break. No, because it's it was hard... the same metal. Yep. Okay, that makes more sense. So I was like my, saying, my, you're using like iron. My favorite part. John Connor was stabbed in the chest before that scene. Damn. Yeah, the Terminator, Dude, got, Terminator got what he wanted, but when, failed when, when was this in the movie? Like it was like, like middle tor- like, part. Cor- no, this was like the towards the end. Then yep. yeah, like probably like about mm-hmm. an hour ish. And then um, they got John Connor out and the cyborg and. Uh, uh, well, how did Kyle he know? When, when did he figure out he was a cyborg? They figured it out in the middle of the movie. Oh, I'm not real. When, uh, when because the, um, um, the girl, the was, cyborg, the, a cyborg was walking with a resistant woman, and they walked through a landmine, and she says. Don't worry, these mines are all magnetic. It, <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> and uh, and when as they're walking by, the magnets are like doing this, shaking toward near when he's near them. And then he got so close to one of them, it fucking just did. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> and blows him up, and they're just like, and they rush him into like the ER. Her name or is Blair. And then they they cut open his shirt, his work on. And then she's like, does she have a metal leg? Over. They think he had a, a prostate leg, prosthetic a, leg. And then the, they see that the, the heart, his entire body is just metal. That's oh. everything. They yeah. see the heart. They're like, "This is a different fucking Terminator," but it's a Terminator. We hate Terminators. We need to kill him. He so needs to die. My my favorite part is where Marcus wakes we haven't up. Haven't got to you yet. Oh my god. Fuck okay. You. So my favorite part is where Marcus, you know, gets in Skynet, finds out the truth, what happened to his body, cyber dies to some, the woman dies of cancer, and he finally wakes up, and he's talking to the girl, because Skynet can go to any face that feels comfortable, and he was like, John Connor was, you know, looking for Kyle Reese, and then he meets the T-5000, and then he's like, you can't... Skynet tells Marcus, the cyborg... That saying is, like his this, mission was programmed to no, bring John Connor home. Yes, and Skynet has been preparing for this moment. Like they really, really wanted him to find those two, and he did. That was, but he didn't know that was his mission. That yep. just, I think the downfall. So, they would have succeeded if they didn't make the the guys like. Human. Well, they didn't know it was going to backfire. Obviously, it's human humanity. Yeah. Well, they they thought he well, so he he basically was telling him, and then Nikki John Connor gets his yeah. ass beat, and and then he's like. Let me go or something like that. No, he let me go. Oh no, he grabs uh, he's, the he, chip because the she, she because shows Skynet is tracking no, yeah. him. With she the chip grabs behind the his chip head. and he's like, he, he's like, I'm better this way. You cannot save John Connor. He, he looks like he's like, watch me, bitch. And he fucking jumps to the window and saves John Connor, as she said. Yeah, that was my favorite. What part. would you give? What's the worst part of the bit of the movie? <laughs> okay. Here you go, Brandon. I'm waiting. Still waiting. Waiting. Still waiting. <laughs> waiting. The old lady that helped in the gas station. Really? <laughs> like, really? No. What happened to the old lady? Did she get killed or something? She got grabbed by a giant mech. Oh. 
I Ooh. know that black guy was. I'm not saying I'm racist or anything. He was kind of annoying. You know, you could just said that. You could just said the black guy, and we would have been fine with it. But now I think you're racist. You don't want sexist. True. <laughs> <laughs> you got me there. We have been sexist in this episode. Go ahead. What's what's your what's your least favorite part? God, please give that one, Jared. This got to something. be honest. Is um, and not a single when Marcus meets uh, Kyle Reese. Oh. Mm. I thought yeah. he was gonna be like. I thought he was gonna be like. You're not. That the, part could have been introduced a little better. I yeah. it's, it's perfect. He fucking yells at the deaf kid, and John's like, uh, Kyle's like, she doesn't talk, and grabs a shotgun and teaches them on that rope method. Yeah. You see in Terminator One where he ties the rope down. That's how you make like, yeah. mark his trip. What name? would you give? The, I don't have one. I don't remember this uh, movie. Okay. This one is I, my, I keep jumping through. It's movies, definitely on my. Top I keep five. I keep picking keep picking movies. I keep I keep picking, you know, th- picking little movies from each other movie and putting it in the movie where I think it's actually there, mm-hmm. but it's not really there. Just give it a guess. I don't know. Don't worry. All the scenes that you keep thinking of are is in the next one. Don't worry. Okay. I give this one a zero because I don't know anything. Oh, of course. I, don't fucking care. I give it an eight because I actually enjoy this movie. Fuck this movie, dog. I give it an eight because it's a good one. Man, this is a lot better than fuck this. you, homie. Oh, fuck you. All right, boy. next movie, Genesis. Okay, uh, before oh, we start, before God. we start, before we start. Budget. <clears throat> recap. The 30 budget. Seconds. Oh, God. Recap. I don't recap. We already know what's going on. Not really. Pay attention. Wait, what do you get? Put your phone down. I'm not. I'm texting someone. Let me see. Show me your text messages. Get off of there. It's private. You're cheating. He's talking to a woman. Dude, he's going to cheat, bro. He's cheating. What was your budget? He doesn't count when he says it. Fine. I was he looking, was looking it up. I, Piece yeah, of shit. I dude. know. He had Google. Go ahead. <laughs> Shut up, Jared. Uh, I was he's got Google, too. Yeah, but I'm looking at the he movies. He has the movies. He doesn't have the budget. For cast and movies, you fucking bitch. Just give me the fucking Anyway, <laughs> um, I will say $250 million. Okay. Because mm, the last ones, what the other ones are higher, right? They got higher as they went up. Yes. That's why I said two hundred fifty. Just in case. Three hundred fifty million. Three hundred fifty million. Are we high? <sighs> you guys are fucking high. <laughs> it is a one. It was one hundred fifty-five mil. Really lower? Yes. 155 million? God damn. No, no fucking, fucking skyrocket that I thought it would be 250 million. The budget something. was 155. God damn, they went I low. don't know how much they made from it. God damn, they went low for this one. Uh, they This one was their lowest. Oh, here it is. They, 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 made, the they made 400. It's not really the lowest. They made 440 the million lowest. dollars back. This one was the lowest Terminator movie they made. No, it's not. The no, it's not lowest. the first this, one. This movie was the shit. No, I'm talking about the, the box office. They made a lot of money still. They made four hundred and forty million. Yeah, that that's the highest fucking one. That's higher. That's the highest fucking box office amount they've gotten. It says Terminator Genesis grossed oh it says right here. Well, I think that's today. I think it says right here Terminator grossed eighty nine point seven million. You're I don't know, let Jared do shit. It. Let Jared do it. Jared's the professional. So box office it made four hundred and forty million dollars. Yeah. Hundred and fifty five no, million. It says hundred and fifty five million. No, the box office. It's made. right there. Box office. Oh, oh. Oh, the budget was 155 million. That's literally what I said. Yeah. But they they said this terminal was the lowest no, um, box they're... office received. They lied to you. <laughs> it's not true. It's it, not true. This one was the Fox most hated. Well, they they said this one was the most hated Terminator on the planet. No, I say Dark Fate is the most hated. The newest one. Okay, so what was the the um, bo- Genesis? But, I actually. How like. much money did they make back? God damn it. Just said it. You said that's something their budget. 50, 50. That's the box office. That means that's how much they got back. Yeah, so I said it right. I was yes. right the first time. Was why am I? He why am I? He was the one that was I'm getting thrown you. off. Brandon was the one that was questioning you. What was the next movie? Well, we're on Genesis right now. What's the next one? The next one's Dark Fate, which is the last one they made. And it's fucking shit. <laughs> Damn, 40, 400, damn. So, I don't know. Told the you. only thing I remember in this movie is John Connor gets turned into a Terminator, or gets turned into oh, a yeah. Terminator okay, or something. Okay, Genesis was but a new type. It, it's, yeah. a, it's a T-3000. It's, a, yeah, uh, it's, they say it's, it's magnetic. A That's why I said T-3000. You said three. I said three. You said he did say three. three. I'm I said two. three. Zach yeah, heard they, me. They T-3000. Two. They call it two. No. It's a three. Look it up. 
I don't fucking know. I got it's, it. a, it's a three. So I know it's anyway, a three. this movie is pretty cool. What Terminator was John um, Connor what type Genesis? Of was <laughs> God. This this movie is pretty cool. It had um the, oh, the a new type and a See, brand new type. I know it. And a brand new type. And a brand new type of Terminator. It was really cool. It was like similar to the liquid one, but I But it was kinda, more it's uh, more nano. Yeah, nano. nano type. It was it was magnet basically. It, he got turned he got turned in the future. He got turned into uh, a Terminator by, by the Doctor Fate guy. He, yeah, he, no. The Doctor, Doctor Who. Doctor Who. What the he fuck gets is turned into. Uh, what's the actor's name? He's Doctor Who. Let me see his face, uh, and I can fuck tell you. Me, I'm a fuck you. I got it. So yeah, the, my favorite part is like my favorite part in that movie is not a single thing. There he is. <laughs> oh shit! He was a Terminator type too. He is a um, T five thousand. His name is Matt Smith. Let me see his face. What the fuck is a T T five thousand? You're correct. Yeah, Matt Smith played one of the Terminators. And he played a he was like a version of T five thousand. He was the like the AI. Fuck is a five thousand? I never heard that. It's the one that turned John Connor. It's an AI. Well, it's Skynet body. Yeah, basically. but it's the new body that Skynet made to turn John Connor into the T. Uh, yeah, he turned. He grabbed his face and turned him into a. Well, I just a never heard of a five thousand series before. I can't so. think of what happened. I think my favorite mo- my favorite parts when they uh uh, ter- uh, John, uh it, what's his fake. <laughs> The T eight hundred stick his fist in his chest and he couldn't like you mean regenerate. pops couldn't you phase pops? out he couldn't phase out because yeah. it was a magnet holding yeah up. so I like how him. Sarah is the girl from the, um, Games of Thrones yeah and she's like I call him pops his name is pops because I pop his ass whose name's pops that's what she named that's him. what she names because T eight hundred yes that was her father figure basically because the father died and her parents she, what she's in this movie yeah. Yeah, he she's Daenerys in Game of Thrones. I know, but what? John Connor gets a smash that. I mean, Kyle Reese gets she's a smash nurse that. or something. No, no, she's John, she's Sarah Connor. So in this, That's verse, her in the movie. so in this timeline, instead of Sarah being a, um, so apparently they they sent a Terminator T one thousand back in like when she was barely a kid. No, they sent. Uh, yeah, they they, sent, she said that they sent like a normal Terminator a T no, after a, her, and then they sent a T one thousand at the time when John Connor was around. Well, as a kid, it's coming. It's taking place over the timeline. No, no, no. In, in Genesis, she was explaining why the timeline changed, and she said, "Well, when I was a kid, how do they know it changed?" Well, they they tried killing her when she was a kid. Yeah, the literally, and the Arnold T eight hundred literally comes when Sarah Connor is like, but we don't know a who we don't know who programmed her. This him. is why I don't like these movies because it's fucking all confusing. So no, she was saying to oh, Kyle worry. Reese, Dark Fate is, makes no sense. So, so, Kyle, so no, Kyle Reese was explaining how how why are you different? Oh, She's like, God. when I was a kid. This is they sent a Terminator back to kill me, Too and I was. And the, they were they were at the lake with her father and her mom. Obviously, Pops rescued her, and then he called her Pops ever since she grew up. Enemy. So, what is your favorite part of this movie? Mm. Go. Boring. It's where Pops is getting. Oh, oh. He's getting penetrated or something. No. It's where Pops was like. A, Fucking shotguns, fucking John Connor, like in the middle of a oh, fucking oh, in the in the parking, parking, parking lot, parking lot. And, yeah. And Kyle's like, "Why would you do that?" But Sarah, Con- he grabs fucking John. Uh, Kyle starts choking him, and she's like, points against like, drop him now, pops. And then he does, and then you see they see John Connor just like, <laughs> he's like, "Oh, is that supposed to hurt? I never felt that before." That was cool. I don't like the way you said that. Well, Some very sexual. Uh, it is a T one thousand that tried to kill her. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, and, what's your favorite and, part? And, sorry, in this movie, uh, the bus chase. That was a the cool scene. The bus chase. <laughs> bad boys. Can you explain bad what happened? boys. So, um, uh, Kyle Crease, Sir Connor, and Pops. Wait. Motherfucker. <laughs> Hello. You're good. Okay. Anyway, so they're getting ready. They're arming up mm-hmm. to destroy Genesis. That's the new Skynet. Yeah. And uh, uh, John Connor finds them because he, mm. he, he knows because he knew that Sarah Connor had all kinds of bunkers, and he knew this. That's how he got the weapons in particular. Resistance. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, so he goes after them. He tells them, "I'll end this quick if you just surrender. I'll kill you. So I'll kill you fast if you just surrender. Even though know you're my yep. parents, I'll fucking kill you both. Yep." And that, wouldn't that mean he wouldn't exist? No, the no, well, Skynet has found a way to make sure that he does survive. Don't know. I, I didn't know that. So, no, what's funny about that Skynet is even says it. when oh, Arnold don't was don't explaining, because Kyle Reese was like, how the fuck, what happened to John? Arnold was explaining explain that what your Skynet. Part was? No, he just interrupted me. Shut up, Brandon! <laughs> 
Good. <laughs> Sorry, Brandon. You're good. No, anyway, no, 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 no. You. He tried. Wait. Hold on. Sorry. You. <laughs> you mu- <laughs> okay, go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. Press this again. You can just hear it. Okay. Shut the fuck up, you son of. It. <laughs> Shut the freaking bleep you, fuck. You son of a bitch. <laughs> You're supposed to bleep fuck. You know what? <laughs> fuck you. You go. Yourself. <laughs> go. You. Yourself. <laughs> Okay, you did it really terrible. I did terrible. Okay, go ahead. What, 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 what's your favorite part? You need to explain that. Let me okay, understand what so it, they what blow it was. up the bunker uh-huh. with John Connor in it. John Connor comes out of it with fi- just full on, just on fire. That's <laughs> completely. Cool fire. Yep, because they blew the bunker up. Yep, Man. and then, uh, he and the fire goes out because his nanotech uh, wishes it out, and then he transforms back to his normal form, but with in new clothes. clothes. I don't know how the fuck. And then. Before that, John, uh, uh, Kyle Reese, Sarah Connor, and Pops get into a bus that they just hijacked. Surprised there's Damn. no kids on it. Yeah. <laughs> well, there was no one on it, thankfully. <laughs> they drive away, and uh, John Connor finds a bike, and a, bike, a motorcycle, and just fucking... fucking meow. Meow. Like in T2. <clears throat> when you say bicycle, I think of a bicycle. Yeah. I know. Well, that's, like why he, tr- that's why I fixed <laughs> myself. He's like on a mini bike, or not, <laughs> like on like a little, a little, bike. little, little, bike, little bicycle. He's really fast. Like, I'm going to get you guys there. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, and then they go down. Uh, what was the bridge in, in the Golden Gate Bridge? San it's Francisco. The, it's the, it's the, Golden the Golden Gate, Gate bridge. bridge. Yeah, they go down that bridge. And why does every movie have that? I don't know. Because it's the most popular location. Everyone's like, in San Francisco. Okay, so they like blowing up San Francisco and destroying Everyone's New in York California. for fucking. Really, really anyway, mean. so John Connor, they uh, he uh, they thought that he like uh, flipped. But yeah, actually, uh, he was uh, under the bus. Okay, you didn't out, have to do that. Taking out all of the uh, magnets, uh, all of the uh, like taking out the brakes, taking out the gas, <laughs> trying to stop them. Yep. Well, and then first he, he takes out the brakes from the floor. <laughs> well, first he takes out the brakes and he cuts the lines. Yep. And then uh, he should have just took out the tire wheels. And then he takes one of the like the middle bar mm. that's like that's keeping the tire tires together. Yeah. He fucking just rips it out and makes the bus flip. Damn. No, he jams it into the, yeah, the, the he, ground. He takes it bus. out, jams it into the ground. And flips uh, the bus. And flips the bus this way, and then it went sideways, flipping this way. How the fuck Ugh. did people... How did they... Serve, can you stop burping? How the hell did they survive? Well, Pops can survive that. He said, Sarah... How no, no. did they live? They would have the, died. The, the funny part is, like, Sarah, wear your seatbelt. That's the reason why she survived. <laughs> is there seatbelts in a bus? Yeah. I thought there wasn't seatbelts. Well, there seatbelts, but no the, one knew he was the driver. the bus driver. Yeah, I mean. he, he well, when he they got to the bus, he's like, "Sarah, wear your seatbelt now," because that's her job. It is his job is to protect Sarah all the yeah. time. His she job, would have probably died. If but Kyle Reese, he was not wearing a fucking. How is he alive? Because he, he was safe on the cushions. He the, was kind of like of catching seats. himself. Yeah. Like, Dumb. He should have died. And then Kyle Reese, not Kyle Reese, John Connor comes from the back of the bus where the door is open. Facing towards the water because they're hanging off the side of the bridge. Oh yeah, okay, so and he's slowly just fucking coming up after Kyle and. Oh, he's also oh, he's mag- at the bottom. He, he yeah. magged himself to mm. the floor, kind of. So yeah. my my favorite part is where they're at the hospital and they're on the top of the. They get to the chopper scene. Though that part was cool. He's like they're they're she was, John was chasing him, shooting him get with the, to the chopper. Basically, and my favorite part is where John and Arnold just like gets gets like great. He's like, "Where are you going? Oh, yeah. I'll be back." Oh, yeah. oh, oh, he dies right through the chopper. That was a cool scene too. Really? What's your least favorite? Oh, oh what's your least favorite? Sarah was kind of annoying in this one. She's a bitch. Yeah, we're pretty sexist on this podcast. <laughs> Like the character, she was like, "I don't need your help." She's a dumb. Yeah, yeah, we're all sexy. Yeah. I don't a, need I'm you. Pops and you can do it, John. You don't have to. F- no, Kyrie, you don't have to fuck me you. and put the soldier in my goddamn belly. That's not what she was saying. She was all saying, right, I don't need to have a baby. What's I don't least, need to have sex. With what's you. your least favorite part? Um, please hit the woman. <laughs> Fucking shit on her. <laughs> wow, Kyrie's his family is annoying too. <laughs> Um, I was saying. Isn't the uncle in this game the the uncle? uncle Isn't he in this movie? Game? No movie. So no, he's not. Uncle Uncle Rike? Whatever. No. Yeah. He's no. not. Uh, my least favorite part is when it, they're in the jail. They're at the like the police station and they're oh, just yeah, questioning. Oh yeah, bad boys, bad boys. They're just questioning everybody and just just and there's here's Arnold just sitting there being and quiet. just smiles. And then when he knows that when the John Connor was around because he can shape shift too. What? Yeah, he's a T. He's a T. Three. He's got everything the liquid metal does. Yep, but the T. Hundred. It's, 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 it's better. It's it's Arnold. It's a, no, 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 John Connor. 
Because oh, Arnold, Arnold was, I thought you were saying John Con- or so Arnold when, just all of a sudden no, no. shifts. Like, so when the cop was interrogating what Arnold, it's like, hey, why do you have all these weapons? Why do you have yeah. this safe for? And then he looks at where the where the other he could see through the glass. He recognized John Connor was in there. glass, and he and John Connor was disguised as a uh, woman. Oh, okay. And, and he, he shape just, shifts, and, he, and Arnold just gets up, breaks, rips the, the fucking. The guy freaks the fuck out. Like, what the fuck is going on? What the fuck? Yeah, and Get then, on the floor! And John Connor was killing all the cops except well, J.K. Simons was in his the, He was the J.K. Yeah. Simmons? Yeah, Simmons. he was a, a Omni-Man because he was a reporter. What? Yeah. Watch that be Spider-Man. Well, he's like he, all so ripped in. The reason why that he was sick. in there is because in the first scene when Kyle Reese goes back in time, he was the young version. He was the young rookie cop and he basically mm-hmm. remembers them from like 20, 30 years ago. Yeah, and he's a detective now. And now let me finish, please. So, yeah. Let so John Connor finish, was about bitch. to kill the reporter, aka Simmons. He was he's a detective, yeah. and then Arnold just fucking bursts through the one way glass and wall <laughs> just to Damn. get the John. Connor. Actually, he's a detective, not a, not a reporter. He's a detective. Does it fucking matter? Yes, it does. They Detec- call him crazy either way. Yeah, I know. Anyway, he's the only one that believes Sarah. What would you give your rating? Ooh, Genesis is probably like a five. Genesis a solid and a five. Damn. Uh-huh. Really, it, it wasn't terrible. I, okay, I, I give it about a seven and a half in my mm, opinion. Actually, I change it to a. You know what, you I, guess I, I change it to it a seven. What? Yes. Zero. A zero. <laughs> I give it a seven. I don't think any of these move the newer movies. They're all poo. Now the favorite movie of all time. All right, now we're getting to the last movie. Ah! This there's, movie. Sucks. There's also a show. We're not. Yeah, talk, I don't know anything about the show. We, I've not even watched it. You got to watch. It's good. I'm not doing it. I refuse. Alrighty, we're talking about the next movie is Dark Fate. Terminator Dark Fate 2023. No, it's 2019. 2019. Shut the fuck up. If I take your dollar. Anyway, how much do you think this movie, what was the budget? Oh, God. Give me is a guess. High? I just fucking guess. Fucking look is at my it phone. high or low? Don't I fucking say... look at my phone. It's not, it's nowhere near a number. <laughs> Not, what do you what? mean? I'm not gonna say. It's gonna cheat. Just fucking guess. Damn. I, it's it's in the hundred mil or not hundred mil. It's in the it's in the millions. That's a lot of movies. Won't give me a number. I, it's higher than you think. Three hundred million. Okay. Go ahead. Right? <laughs> What's your guess? Five hundred million. Oh my god. You guys are fucking high again. 185 to 196 million dollars really? to make the 185? movie. 185? 185 to 196 Dang. to make so, this movie. So they even say what the real budget is. It's just like, I'm around there. It's one of them, too. I don't know what they made back. Um, I'm not sure. But I've only seen a little bit this. Oh, here. I've only seen a little bit this movie because I've only seen like half the movie. And they took fucking, oh, so boring, dude. It was like the boring. I really didn't like it. It was so boring. And I think it was stupid that they killed John Connor out the bat and they have this new chick that's supposed to take over. Yeah, the new timeline. And it's and weird. You know, it's funny. And it's it's not even Skynet it anymore. It probably it's, because it's I'm sexist. No, 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 no. You're right. Uh-oh. We're Not sexist? No. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay, maybe. No, no, no. So, anyway, but no, no, no. The whole, one John Connor died, yeah. Skynet didn't become a thing at all. At yeah. all. What was the new thing called? Legion. So, Legion. Okay. And so, apparently this is actually alien shit. Makes no fucking sense. Okay. No, no, no. So it's the same thing as Skynet, just a different AI. And he I just heard an it, alien. I heard it was an AI. Yeah, is but a have you robot. seen but did you see what the movie they literally said it's an alien. Have they literally said it? it's an alien. They well, have you seen? Stars. Have you seen what the monster? Have you seen what the robots look like? They look like aliens. That's Skynet. Legion's one of Legion's weapons. No, it's it not. looks like an alien. No, Skynet. So, they literally said Skynet is destroyed. Even the fucking Terminator eight eight hundred literally said Skynet was destroyed when John Connor. Okay, was anyway, even, my gripes. I'm gonna tell you my gripes about this movie. If I can fucking talk about you, I mean, can can I, I can I, just can like, fuck can you. I, I don't fucking care. Fuck no, you. Fuck so, you. Go fuck yourself. I hate you. So. So Skynet was finally eradicated because they did they they destroyed it, but somehow fucking Skynet's unedible. I, Skynet decided to go a full. G- you mean Sky, you, Skynet? Skynet decided is inevitable? to do SWAT. Wow, what's up? I got the back, the box office for this. Let one. me guess. I'll be the one the guessing now. It was very low. This one was the worst rating one ever. It probably got. Is it high? No, it was the lowest box office. I want to say it's higher than. 28 million. 200 mil. You're 
close. How much is it? $261 million. Damn. Dude, that was off Even by though it six flopped million. in the box office, it, it lost. It was off by six million. Well, no, they, 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 put, they, they put a lot of money in it. It, it didn't even million. gain what? half of the money it, gained, it spent. They made, movie. that's probably the most they made, I think. Of no, all. The, they, the 440 is the most made. This one's higher than the first movie. Uh, Dark higher Fate. Higher than the first and so second. They put I a think lot the of only reason this movie made money is because it's Arnold. the franchise. Yeah. Well, also, I've been told this one's the lowest one because they put a lot of money into it. It's probably the lowest rated. Well, also, it didn't make back the money it was they, they put into it. They said they lost money from it. I already told you the number they made. They lost the money. They made, no, they no, made they, more they, money. They're saying they were like trying to make more money than that. Like try to make they it lost. over four hundred forty million. Oh, they didn't do it, and they yeah. didn't do it. They yeah. didn't successfully do it. James Cameron and so, Tom Miller could have made the it. The way I understand this movie so far is that what I've I got to watch, which wasn't very long, is John Connor died in the beginning. He yeah, got he got found by one of the Terminators. That was apparently the sent back. And it's the again. same one that's in this movie. They sent multiple ones back. So. so somehow they found him. Don't know how they found him, but they on that they found him somehow because he was he was hiding and he wasn't trackable. But then he died somehow. Well, they Sarah Connor and John Connor weren't really hiding. They thought they destroyed Skynet. I thought they said they were hiding. If I remember, they were. Sarah Connor literally said they destroyed Skynet. Everything would be fine. And then here comes Arnold with a shotgun and shoots fucking. Yeah, he John kills. Arnold. He kills John Connor. And they're in a restaurant. He shows Scott Connor. And John was resing up a girl. He's like, "Hey, yo, you looking? So basically, it. John Connor <laughs> dies. John Connor dies, and then what's her face? What's her name? Jimmy? Uh, Sarah. 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 Whatever. Sarah. Jimmy. Sarah Connor Jimmy. gets in the depression and then we never see her for a long time. Well, uh, and they jump like, I think 15 years or something. Or no, they don't really something. say. They, go by the timeline they jump, the they jump forward and now we have this new character. Don't remember her name. Grace. Two new characters. Uh, Grace and Danny. How many times I going to tell you? Just stop burping. In I'll the, burp. At least I'll burp that way or that way or. Or up there, or, or ev- never anywhere uh, that's not in the microphone. Why? Because I'm sure our our listeners don't want to hear you burp. They love it when I. Burp. Anyway, I'm giving you too much time right now. So anyway, anyway, the the, the thing I understand is uh, they jump forward. And there's new new character, the chick, and Danny, she and her dad. Grace. Her dad. She's with her dad. She doesn't have her mom anymore. What? Right? No. I don't, I don't know. The girl name is Danny, and her brother, what the fuck his name is? There, they work at a factory. Yeah. Yeah, I'm saying her dad, then, uh, her mom's dead or something, right? No, yeah, I don't no. know what happened to the mom. No, they didn't say the mom's dead, but um, she's not there though. Anyway, it's just the dad. I'll finish for you. The Rev Nine comes right actually with a low. Can I please <laughs> speak? I was trying to say what oh, Zach was sorry. trying to say. I'm yeah. Sorry. yeah, my God, <laughs> they I work in know. a factory. Anyway, so they work in a factory, and uh, the main character and her brother are getting pissed off because they're replacing the workers with machines. Yeah, because it's cheaper, yeah. China. Yep. No, they're not in China. Just, just <laughs> ignore them. Anyway, so China. They're trying to f- just ignore them. The dad's trying to tell. Just push through. <laughs> the I'm dad's sorry. trying to tell the daughter and the son that they should uh, work, go to school to see if they can learn about these machines. Yeah. And the really? daughter's like, I don't want to do that because it would cost so much money. Yeah. I don't remember that scene. And then they go to work one day, and uh, the Rev Nine, the fucking new Terminator bad guy. Well, there, there's also this one chick as well. We forgot to mention. Oh yeah, the new she's the new Grace. cyborg. Well, she's not. She's she's all she, she entered she's, into the she's, the cyborg. She's a hybrid. Program. She's not a term. She's a hybrid. That's why I said cyborg. Yeah, cyborg. She's like Marcus. You can say kind of like Marcus. Yeah. You don't know what a cyborg is. Yes, it's half human, half, half robot. robot. That's a cyborg, and that's you. what fuck she is. I'm gonna lick you. I just, stop talking. Why are you here? Did you you, me? <laughs> <laughs> you want it? Go ahead. Anyway. So, I'm just giving that a context. So the Rev Nine finds the dad of these two characters, and asks, kills him, takes his identity. Wait, he kills the dad? Yep. Yeah, because you. Damn. And the, then it goes to the factory where they work with the bag and is about food. to kill them. And then the cyborg comes in to save both of them. Well, she, she comes. She comes in. Mainly she comes the in. Girl. The robot comes in and pretends to be the dad. Yeah, yep. he. They, they. She shoots him, and, and she's, then the cyborg. Well, she was about. She pulls worker. out a gun and was about to shoot the the little it was the a girl. Shotgun. The and lunch bag was turned into a gun. Whatever, dude. No, it was a pistol. It was a pistol. Whatever. Yeah. I don't fucking care. The she Red tried. Nine had a pistol. He but tries to for kill some her. Reason, it it doesn't even need a fucking pistol because the son of a bitch can summon weapons like <laughs> spears. Yeah, this robot is like the mixture of uh, the T one thousand and it has a skeleton and a T eight hundred. T eight hundred, but with missing half its head. Well, yeah, yeah. It's a fucking alien robot. It's not an so, alien. Yeah. Yes, it is. This probably has to be. Yep, yeah, but. 
they 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 fight each other the the cyborg and and the uh, grace girl the, whatever. yeah whatever the cyborg and the robot start fighting each other to get away uh, so they get away and I think this is when Sarah Connor comes in somewhere she, more like at she, the bridge she, she, Sarah Connor uh, Sarah Connor comes in after all of that bullshit. Yeah, after she the brother blows them up. They're in a highway, and she blows up the car that the t- that the Rev Nine is in. And she takes the she takes the uh, Terminator's line. I'll be back. It was the most. She okay. Everybody was nutting over it. I'll right, be so back. So my favorite part is probably where, um, I would say where boring, where Sarah comes like the first part where Sarah comes out. She like slow motion gets out of the vehicle and just starts douche douche douche, fucking blows the robot. That was really cool. Yeah, but uh, she, when she says I'll be back and throws a bomb, throws a grenade and walks away, and then poof, when do they find they they track down? Um, his name is Charlie. Is that what the robot's name is? Oh, is Charlie? I don't know. I'm pretty it's, sure his name's Charlie or something. I, I think it was Charlie. But anyway, the, this is the it truth. Be, yeah. This is why I say this thing is a fucking it's alien. Fucking, yeah. I know it looks like an alien. Google. Yeah, I don't know. That's it a literally does. That's not. It's literally That's an alien. Not normal. That's the new Terminator. Alien. Tell, let us know in the comment down below if you fucking made it this far. Jesus Christ. Well, let me know if you think it's an alien or not. It's if you made Legion. it this far, I Unless fucking Legion bless is a you. Alien AI, and they made by. I freaking got through this hellscape <laughs> of a podcast. Yeah, but uh, what's your favorite part of the movie? All right, you already said. What about you, Jared? <laughs> Can you just give me? Give, just make up one. Dude. To be honest, when Sarah Connor comes in, Sarah Connor. Yeah. That's the only good part. The only guys, good part. You guys want to know? I don't know fact anything about else. The movie? I haven't watched so much of it. What? So you know how Arnold's ah, always been the lead actor in every voice. Terminator movie, almost. Yeah. Yes. So this is the reason why she came in. They said you're going to be the lead actor. So Sarah Connor was who's very. Gonna be, wait, who's going to be the lead actor? So Sarah Connor was the main character. Her, her te- yeah, the main character. Well, she's not though. She technically is. She's not though. Instead of Arnold, it's her, and she's she was. Not, she though. made the most money in that movie, and she was she, very happy. She's not though. Danny, where the fuck they changed her to a girl, not to be sexist. Ha uh, who? They killed John. Do you okay? Another cool fact: John Connor was supposed to die, and you know why? Do you want to know why I don't know anything about this movie? Because you didn't let me finish it. So the reason why they killed John Connor is because James Cameron and Tom Miller thought it would be a good idea to open up a new, fresh ideas. It wasn't. It's was just a copy and paste. You know, every single Terminator movie is a copy and paste with just a new robot and a new character and they, a new oh, timeline. Well, That's actually, every not movie. Really a new character. No, they just come At with least a new, new one. This one's a new. Right, they so just let's reboot. Rate this god awful. This movie. movie what, what do you? I don't know. I don't. Zero. I'm gonna give it a negative 100. I give it Damn. a fucking four. Damn. Damn. Negative 100. Damn. Uh, let's talk about the next movie that's coming out. It's called Terminator. Go fuck yourself. Go, f- go fuck yourself. Actually, James- How much, what's the budget you think this movie is? Lower. Give me one. Give me a number. One dollar. <laughs> what about you? Give me a number. One cent. Damn, one cent. I give it a hundred million. Billion, actually. A hundred billion budget. That's impossible. Trillion, sorry. That's like Elon that's Musk. That's also... Impossible. They better make a fucking damn good movie. So there's a report that James Cameron is actually writing a seventh strip for Terminator. Uh, just let it in. He's it actually end. gonna use technology. All right. In anyway, let's get, the, let's, get, let, 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 let's get out of this fucking hellscape. I want to get the yes. fuck out of this fucking podcast. Yes, let's do it. So let me know what you guys your favorite podcast Term- is. Let me know your favorite Terminator, Terminator movie, movie or any movie in general you want us to cover. Let us know because we're gonna be posting at least once a week or maybe twice or may, every other week. I don't know. Depends how many times we do this, but let me know if you guys liked today's episode. And this is Jared's channel. Well, I'm, I'm letting you take it over because I'm fucking tired. And Brandon, tired of this Brandon's bullshit. tired in here. Jared, Jared's tired of hearing your voice. So Jared go check out Brandon's me. channel. It is Crazy, uh, Crazy Shark Z on YouTube. Go check out Neptune Man. Um, check me out, I guess. You go check out Lord Lord. This is his channel. <laughs> check him out. He's right here. <laughs> Subscribe. Yep. Bye. Oh, I also want to thank Jared for having me. Nope. Bye. Can't hear you. I'm ending. Bye.